Okay, what I'm going to show you here is uh, how, to t how to test the input and output sensors on a 42 RLE transmission. And you could do this with probably Chevrolet or any of them. And uh, these, these operate kind of sort of on a Hall Effect device. But I think inside here, I think these have coils. Uh, this has got a coil of wire in it and stuff, but you induce you're inducing AC uh, a AC current in there because uh, that's what they that's what they generate is an AC signal. So you hook you hook two wires on the on the connectors. You hook one to the scope probe and you're running one to one, and uh, the other probe you hook it to the other wire for ground. And uh, so when you when you pass a piece of metal in front of this thing if you can see the if you can see the scope there deflecting there's nothing wrong with this switch get it real up close right there and pass it right back and forth and uh, you can see that and and you can test the other one the same way so you know that's that's one one way you could test those uh, if, you, if, if you don't have a scope, you could probably do it on a voltmeter, just setting it, set, setting the sensitivity. I haven't got it hooked up though, but you could probably do that. Set it on AC volts and pass that piece of metal right across the face of that uh, sensor, and you should get an AC voltage deflection on that uh, on that voltmeter setting it on AC uh, setting it to like I don't know auto voltage or something like that that would work but just watch for a voltage when you when you pass that through there you should be able to get something and if you if you get something at all it's probably good okay that's it you can test the other one the same way Okay, that's it.